Welcome back to EMC, everyone. What's up? This is Black Series Day. We got a special Black Series along with our C63 Black Series. And this one is a good friend of ours. This is the SLS Black Series. One of 350. So, Ryan drove uh, Dizzy C63 Black Series, and uh, what do you think, man? Um, you know, the, sh the shifts were pretty crisp. Yeah. I, didn't, I wasn't expecting that, because it's, it's a 10-year-old car, right? Uh, yeah. What did you do to the exhaust? Jesus, it sounds like a fucking beast. What was that? Well, we have the Super Sprint headers, Akrapovich, you know, full exhaust, HJS Cats, we have Rentec ECU, Rentec okay, so intakes, you see yeah, okay, okay. and also Rentec throttle body. Yeah, so pretty much this one is very modified. Uh, I tried to make it as close as possible to the SLS, but I didn't want to spend big bucks on getting the SLS camshafts, SLS intake. But I went with Rentec stuff, but I just didn't get the camshafts. But it's naturally aspirated, so these are appreciating. These are going to go up, and, and after only... these models, they all become turbo, turbocharged, right? After these, yeah, they all turbocharged uh, the 5.5 turbo, the, the 4.0 turbocharged, which is what is in the AMGs now. Now they're going hybrids. Okay, so now this is the last of the NAs, basically. Last of the NAs. And, it's a black, and they're Black Series. So I remember the first Black Series I saw was the CLK Black Series. And uh, back then, that blew my mind because basically they're just wide body versions, <laughs> right? I mean, uh, yeah. they're you know, from, from, the, from the factory, and that's pretty awesome. Uh, tell me more about this SLS. So I know this is a Black Series. Uh, yeah, I think you're telling a... me the fenders are further out, but I yes. can't really tell. You can't really tell. We don't have another you know, standard SLS next to it, but okay. if there was, um, you could tell that the front bumper is very different. It's a little bit wider. I see. So therefore, the whole fender here protrudes out a tiny bit to match the front bumper. And then, because of the wide fenders, the side skirts were a little bit wider as well. And then obviously it's more aggressive, it's got some inlets right here which are all functional, and the inlets right here as well. And everything about the obviously black series... dripping carbon fiber? Yeah, as you can tell, okay. everything carbon fiber. And obviously, you know, a wider rear bumper, it looks just a little bit wider in the rear. And it's got a similar air vent in the rear bumper as the C63. And just like you said, everything carbon fiber. It's just, Drift. it's just sexy, man. Uh, those yeah. are steel or carbon ceramics? Ooh, SLS has carbon ceramics. These are carbon ceramics. Those are steel. I see. Okay. It stops on a dime, man. I you got to, you got to drive this. You got to drive this. Actually, I'm not driving this because uh, <laughs> Ryan has a bad experience with the SLS. Okay. Uh, years ago, when we were sponsoring the rap for Barry Chen. Uh, we sponsored one of his MVs, and I actually got one of my good friends to lend me one of these, and uh, I kind of fucked it up. Uh, I <laughs> fucked it up on a curb. Uh, it cost more to fix than the MV. <laughs> so, so yeah, I'm not driving this thing. Sonny can drive this thing. <laughs> okay, well, yeah, this is true story. I have to say, I am a little bit scared to drive this car. Uh, <laughs> when I heard the value, you know, it's it's close to like San yeah. One. You know, it's like. You know, in Taiwan at least, it's like a 1 million USD car. And it's, it's got an enormous front end. This yeah. thing is this, this, this so long. long, it's longer than my Luso. It's, this, it's is, long. A, this is a long car. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. But the cool thing is, you know, it's got gullwing doors. Doors go up, and these go down. These come down, for sure. You know how it is, baby. <laughs> this is a uh, front mounted mid engine as well. Because if you look at the front, I mean, the That's engine doesn't, doesn't start down here. So this. Kind of reminds me of the Luso. Yeah, so the front axles are here, so it is behind the front, so it's kind of like, yeah, I think you're right, man. Yeah, this is probably a front mount mid engine. Yeah, so we'll take a look at the C63 engine bay in a bit, but this is just gorgeous. Yeah, look at that. Hand built, wow. you know. Oh, it's um, oh <laughs> another cool fact is that well, AMG well, Black this. Series engines are only made by three special, the best AMG technicians 
in their factory. Uh, I met one of them, which is the guy who actually built our engine in the C63. And uh, you know, I'll provide photos. Dizzy and I met him. He was awesome. Hinge right there on the engine. Yeah, let me see. I can't. Oh wait, wait, this is the same guy that built my car. Um, I'll have I have his IG, so his IG is down below. Oh my God, that's the same dude. It's just like you said, everything is dripping. Look at this. This is covered. Oh yeah. So, all right. So there's a big difference between the SLS and the uh, C63. Yeah. That is it. So it's. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And oh, this is functional right here. It is functional. I, th I always thought that was just for looks. Why don't we go for a little drive, and then we're gonna come back here, and we're gonna talk a little bit about the cars. See you. Peace. First time ever driving SLS Black Series. So the biggest difference I see is the steering wheel. The seating position is actually pretty good. There's, you know, indentation here. This part of the gold wing door goes up, so my headroom has more space. And yeah, I like that carbon fiber door sill. It's all Alcantara, this is beautiful. Oh, even Alcantara here. Yeah, carbon fiber center console all throughout. Oh, this is, this slides. So that's pretty cool. This shifter is different than all the other AMGs. It's the same as the C. Uh, it's got Comfort, Sport, Sport Plus, and Manual. It's also got the AMG button. So um, let's just go to Sport Plus. This color is a very special color. If you're a car collector, and especially with the AMG Black Series collectors, if you want the SLS, this yellow, gold, mustard, whatever you call it, this is the color to get. And at the auctions, this is the most expensive. I heard it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. This is more special. You know, it's pretty impressive that this is not modded and it sounds that good and it's still got some pops and bangs. Very, very impressed with that. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> oh, we're fucking animals. <laughs> C63 AMG Black Series. You know, this car is uh, it's a fun little little coupe. <laughs> I, don't know, I don't know if you can hear this, but oh my god, this thing is uh, this thing is uh, got some noise. Things that I like about this car, I feel like this could be an everyday driver. I still feel like you know it's quite drivable, right? Uh, we got comfortable seats. We got a sunroof, right? Oh, I don't know how fast this is around the track, but I think uh, cruising around the city every day, and then you know maybe speeding a little bit, driving a little bit uh, fast on the freeway, this thing is pretty good, right? Um, yeah, solid, solid car. <laughs> Damn! NA baby, NA. So powerful. <laughs> it's not like it's super hard to drive. It's just very big, very long. This is a beast. This is definitely a beast. Things that I don't like about this car. You know, 
but there's not much. Uh, it is an 11, 12 year old car, right? So some of the things are seem a little bit more analogy. Um, I mean, it's still got screens everywhere. I'm not a rear spoiler person, so uh, I would probably get that spoiler off. I mean, if you follow me, you'll know that uh, even my 2JZ Supra, I removed the rear spoiler on that car, right? Yeah, overall, I like it, I like it, uh, minus the wing. We're back. Yep. So what do you think, man? You know, I, I, I love it. I, and I love what you did to this car. I mean, yeah. look at the stance. You, this is like, yeah, you see this? This is completely, it's like flush with the car. Wow, it's, that's, it's a legit wide body. The it's offset got, is like perfect. Booty, 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 yeah. Yeah, like okay. The wheels and everything. Yeah, 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 it's really nice. I did see a button that I really just, I wanted to push. It said AMG on it. There's an AMG button. What the fuck is that? Okay, <laughs> so the AMG button. You see AMG button, you just want to push it, right? Yeah. <laughs> so did you notice after you pushed it, like a new screen came out, right? Like a readout came yeah, out. Yeah, a readout came okay. out. So that's like what, what track special? Yes. You know how there's always new technology, but they test out and kind of like the, the last phase out models mm -hmm. of the AMG button is kind of like their track readout and everything. It was their track, track option. There's a track mode. Track mode, but it could do like you know. Does like it do zero. anything to the car settings? Uh, no, it's actually just you know it reads you know oh, your lap see, times, G force, okay. you know your so tire pressure. That's the other knob. You got to go the S plus, and that's maximum. Yes, yeah, so you got to go S plus, and then you press the AMG button. Okay, that's kind of dope. Yeah. I see, I see. Okay, but, that's cool. I mean, dude, how the car was super fast. fast. Super fast. Super, right? How much? I think like 500 horsepower. Five. Stock, yeah, it was like over 500 horsepower. Okay. A little bit over 500 horsepower, but I would say from the dynos at CPA. Uh, we got around, you know, at the crank, 570, yeah. 580, yeah. you know, that's pretty close to this bad boy, yeah. but obviously, you know, it's a more compact car, yeah. um, it's smaller. I mean, I would love to get a chance to really drive these things, like, outside of the city. Uh, unfortunately, we weren't able to Yeah, but, it's like, but I mean, these are more city cars, yeah, yeah. right? You know, these are more... Collector cars. Collector cars. Yeah, just, yeah. And even the value of the uh, C63 MG Black Series, it went up like another million and a half NTD. If I had a choice, this would be a daily. Um, and if I had the money to spend, you know, one million USD on a car, yeah, I would get this. This, however, is much wider. My favorite Black Series is the SL65. Is the 65 oh, Black Series? Yeah, the SL65. I mean, that one just looks like it got beat up, you know, right? It looks like it has bruises and it's welts because it's so like... It's so DTM <laughs> wide body. Yeah. It's so uh, DTM wide body. That was probably my favorite one. I mean, if you're into Black Series cars and if you have the money, I get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, this is the flagship, right? And this will always and forever be the most iconic Black Series because of the gold wing doors. And the last thing about Black Series is that they only do it every couple years. They don't do it like the regular AMGs, where they just keep producing, keep producing, make more and more of the AMGs. So that's why for collectors, they always go towards the Black Series. And it makes sense. You know, you got the King, you got the Boss, you got the Little Brother. Uh, there's a couple other ones. There's the SLK 55 Black Series. Mm -hmm. There's a CLK 63. Uh, and then you said the SL 65. 65. And then now we have the AMG GT Black Series. Do we even have it in Taiwan, the AMG GT Black Series? Let me know in the comments. If you have one, reach out. We want to know. Yeah. Anyway, thank you, Dizzy, for lending us your car. And thank you to our friend. Thank you very much. However, we do have another episode coming up very soon that took us months and months and months to put together. Uh, yes. That's more down my shit. You know, stay tuned. You're, it's going to blow you away. Yeah, you guys are going to love that vlog. So stay focused. Stay patient. 
That's gonna come out really, really soon. And uh, yeah, last but not least, we did make an AMG Black Series t-shirt. Go get yours, but comment below. Let us know what your favorite Black Series car is. All right, we're gonna pick three lucky winners. So remember, comment, like, share. Let all your friends know. Anyway, peace, EMC, man, let's go. See you guys on the next one.